Welcome to another episode of the House of Wolverine. This week, we'll be taking a look at the advanced weapons elevators aboard USS Gerald R. Ford. Good day, I'm uh, Lieutenant Donnie uh, James, uh, Gerald R. Ford's advanced weapons elevators officer. And my job here is pretty much to manage and maintain uh, Ford class advanced weapons elevators uh, from operating to doing maintenance and just upkeep all elevators we have on board here on Ford. On board the ship here, we have 11 total weapons elevators, advanced weapons elevators. That'll be four um, for upper stage, upper stage weapons elevators, seven lower stage elevators. Um, upper stage elevators are pretty much the ones that service the flight deck and down to the uh, transfer area. As you see here, we're in the uh, aft weapons handling transfer area. Uh, so we have four of those elevators uh, that service from the flight deck to the transfer area. The lower stage elevators primarily go from the hangar bay uh, or main deck area down to the magazines. So that's the primary difference. So it goes from anywhere from uh, the magazines up to the hangar bay or from the transfer area up to the flight deck, completely cutting out, eliminating having to handle ordnance within the hangar bay and in the mess decks as you would see on the Nimitz line. Uh, the unique thing about four class uh, AWEs is it's all electromagnetic. Uh, we don't have the hydraulic system and the, the wire ropes and pulley system as we would have on Nimitz class. All electrical PLC driven, uh, electromagnetic uh, propelled vehicles that move uh, platforms from between the decks. And we have two additional elevators that uh, Nimitz class don't have uh, utility. It's uh, an additional elevator. It's a primary medevac elevator and um, we can also use cargo. Uh, weapons as well, stores, mail, things like that. 